Hey everyone, Thena here. I'm playing a new game called Ever... Or, I think it was E-Shade. Um, it seems like a nice, like... Painting scenario. Relaxing game. So that's what we're going to go for. I've never played it, so let's hope it's good. Loading now. No, it's not loading. There we go. Adventure's name. Alright, let's just do that. Oh, sensitive. Okay. Oh, that seems a little loud. Let me turn that down. Oh, oh, oh. Turn that down just a little. If it gets too loud, some more. Well, oh, there's animals. I can jump. No nope. canvas. Okay. Okay, this must be the menu. Oh. Do that again. Oh, that's my journal. There's no. Oh, okay. Options. Oh, that's that. Okay. Options. There we go. Audio. Let's just turn that down just a little. Okay. That should be enough. I want to apply. Okay, resume. Oh, you're a deer. You're reading something. Nope. Okay. I don't know how to interact with you people. Oh. Forgive an old woman, but I forgot your name. What was it again? Oh, there's voice acting. Would you mind getting my book from the sleeping quarters? It would spare my bones the trip. It's called Great Voyages. Okay. Another monkey. Is this where the sleeping quarters was? Oh, yes. Yes, it was. Uh, the Great Voyage. The seas of the north are widely unexplored. Researchers predict these waters are expensive, expensive and small expeditions have revealed numerous islands filled with device life and communities. Due to the unpredictability and violent nature of these waters, many exploration ships have been lost while attempting to form a new contract and carry out scientific research. All eyes on the harbor. Harbor? properties of Flare S. If found, please return to the port of L London. Okay, interacting and the except are different buttons. Thank you very much. Oh, that I've was read loud. this old book many times. Seems I find something new each read. And no matter how many times I've read it, it never fails to get me excited for adventure. Are you the adventuring type? Here. Ah, after my own heart. I've had a lifetime of it, believe it or not. If you're sticking around in East Shade, maybe I'll tell you all about it sometime. Captain Elona told me we'll be landing in Lindo shortly. I think we're all antsy to arrive. Okay, you've already learned about a new topic. You can now inquire about the topics using the pick topic option when it's present. Not everyone has something to say. Okay. Okay, can I talk to you? I can talk to you. Can I talk to you? Nope. Dear, only the monkeys want to talk to me. I've never been to East Shade. I've heard wonderful things about it. Did you know that the people there used to cover their mouths with garments? I've heard that since gone out of style. Quite a strange fashion fad if you ask me. As long as East Shade doesn't rock like this ship, I will love it. Pick a topic. Okay. It's the quaint little seaside town we'll be landing in. It's one of the many gems of the country, I hear. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Almost there. I go up? Nope. Oh! 
That did not sound good. Watch out. Let's open the door. It's like, open the door, guys. Get out of the bus before we drown. Did I ever tell you about a trip your father and I took to East Side? Anytime. Tell me again. Out of all the trips we took, the one was my favorite, you know, if you ever look for painting inspiration. I know, Mom. Tell me you'll visit it one day. Promise me you'll go. To you think of your exploration East Shade. It makes me so happy. I know you'll find inspiration there. What an adventure you'll have. Okay. Part of the music club. Listen, there are so many places you absolutely must, mustn't must miss. Be sure to paint the giant tree. Oh, I remember it like it was yesterday. What will I know? Which, well, how will I know which tree? You won't miss it. Trust me. And the Tiffmore Bluff. Oh, the lovely skies. Country. I can picture you there now, an easel set, and you making a beautiful painting. These open skies and the endless seas, you'll move any artist. Okay, I will. In the city, there's a magnificent building in the center. From the very top floor, you can see the whole town and more. You won't be able to resist taking out your brushes. And soon, you'll be there soon. You should get some rest, Mom. East Shade. That's what the game's called. Okay. Okay. You've woken. Okay. Options. Audio. Are you feeling okay? I don't think this is messing with any of the volumes. Okay. Don't apply. Just make it easier for you guys. Here. Okay. Yeah, it's not... That audio track thing it doesn't seem to be worth. Okay. Do you remember what happened? I was traveling on a ship. It collided with the reef. I'm glad your memory's intact. You washed up on this beach to sit shot one after the ship's in. Oh, right, that might be doesn't last long in water this cold. Where are we? Did anyone else make it? From what I've heard, you were the only passenger misplaced during the wreck. The others are safe in town. Where are we? East Shade, of course. Specifically, my home. I usually don't take visitors, but in this case, I can hardly blame you for floating in unannounced. Did any of my possessions float only in? Only your easel. Don't forget to take it when you leave. Even the frigid tide couldn't bring you to part from it. Must mean a great deal to you. I won't forget. I about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let them know yourself. Why is it's it echoing? Path. Thank you for your On help. your way, though. Okay. Wait. Oh. oh. Wait. So. Uh. Is that my inventory? Yes. Uh, canvas. I need two boards and fabric. Oh, I can make stuff? Okay. That's interesting. I can jump, right? Oh, no. That's a weird key for jumping. So I have my east, but I have no campuses. I need, um, uh, what's my journal say? Okay, so all we have is find those places and paint. Oh, can I take you? Nope.
That must be the ship there. No music now. Kind of quiet. I run. I can crouch. Wonder if Flat Watcher Tower is going to be a place to go. Plants are pretty. I took it. I take you. I take you. I take you. There we go. Wait, I got it. Okay, I got to look up. Take it. I'm wondering if I can use this to make canvas this stuff. Okay. We go back to my oh no, that's not my inventory. My inventory. I got white glamis a fruit. It sounds hollow. Okay. I'm glad you know what it is, I don't. Fond on. I got some making paintings, drawing inspiration, gains inspiration by exploring new places and trying new things. Okay. That's a big chicken. The black chicken. Oh, person! Hello. Ah, a new cop. In the future, if you're ever in need of carriage to Nava, I'm your driver. If I Okay. I don't know My where that box is. is strong, no? It's an ox. He has painting. <gasps> Cat! Oh, look at the kitties. Cloth. Oh, I should be able to paint things soon. A stick. I need another cloth, right? I'm just. Do you have any more cloth I can take, ma'am? Uh, that was my inventory. I needed... I remember knowing that... Learning how to create... This one? Oh, uh, I need one fabric and a board. Oh, I don't... Sticks won't do... Looks that's like it's flowing. Okay. So I bet oh, I want to run. <gasps> Up and running, guys! So this is, I think, where one of the painting areas might be. I haven't created a campus yet. Okay, I, I need to get supplies. Can I jump down? Nope. Still can't jump down. Okay. Okay. I can talk to you. Do you have a canvas? Oh, it's you. You're on the ship. What happened to you? Why are your eyes closed? Okay. Oh, thank goodness. We thought you were lost. Oh, what a horrible experience. I'm so glad to see you're safe. What brought you to East Shade anyway? Hmm. Very adventurous of you. I came to visit my family. You look like you could use a nice cup of tea. This flavor is a bit strong for some people, but the effects can be lifted with a sip of water from your water skin. Our captain is in a terrible state. I suppose that's to be expected. Mm, she won't even leave the dock. Perhaps it would console her to know that we all survived. You should speak with her. Worry. Okay. I lost most of my possessions too. And nothing has washed up. My family lives here in Lindo, so I'll be staying with them. 
If you find that night is coming and you're in need of a place to stay, you should check the inn. You'll be comfortable there. It gets cold around here at night. You shouldn't be out without a proper coat. After that wreck, I may just settle down here for a while. Okay. Are you wondering about anything else? Okay. I don't know how time I'm passes. Oh, I can talk to you, kid. Aren't I good at flying? Okay, let's hope he doesn't do anything. Thanks. My dad says that I can do anything as long as I put my mind to it. Be careful, kid. Uh, anything here I can just take? I don't even know where the inn is. She didn't tell me that. Oh, painting! Hey, are you an artist? I am. Hey, you have an easel! Are you an artist? So am I! Do you want to see what I made? Okay. Look! Mm, wow, you really worked hard on this. It took all day. But I want to make my next one even better. What should I do? You want to start with a nice canvas. But I don't know how to make a canvas. Make it oh, together. Right! You're a nice artist after all. We'll need to collect boards and fabric. I know where some boards are. Follow me. Perfect, kid. Did you see when it ran a reef? I've never seen anything like that. Terrible waste of a good ship. And it went down so quickly. It's amazing anyone made it out of that. Okay. Now we just need the fabric. Yes. I don't know where to find that. Maybe we should ask someone. Okay. Let's keep going. Are you gonna just follow me, kid? Will anyone talk to me? Oh. Oh, let's play this man up here. I can crouch and run, yeah! A real artist. Okay, do I just paint here? There, go back to where you were. Okay. So I can, oh, I can. Do this. All right, right here. That painting is amazing. I want to try. Can I have a canvas? We found enough stuff, right? Yes. I'm going to use this for Miss Nika's next painting. She loves art so much. Hey, Miss Nika loves art like us. She always likes my paintings. I bet she'd like yours too. She really likes the eclipse. You should draw her that. Okay. Okay. Now you get more bored. So, no. My inventory. And that's all. I gave her all my materials because I'm a good person. Oh, she came like here or something. Oh, cat. Right to the captain. 
this whole finding material is going to be tough. I don't even know what the captain looks like. I never saw them. It didn't come below. So you've survived too. That means only one of us has been lost at sea. Oh, who was lost? Who? Only the most important one of us all, Annabelle. Annabelle, she doesn't sound familiar. It doesn't sound Oh, the, the ship. She carries you across the oceans and you don't even learn her name. Annabelle! My ship! My wooden, sea-loving daughter! Killed by the damned reefs when we came into this miserable town. Kind of you to say so, but kindness does nothing. Bring sweet Annabelle back to me. Can't we? I imagine I'll be spending the rest of my days mourning Annabelle, sitting here, dreaming of a world where she wasn't destroyed and people actually remember her name. Did you tell us her name? Off with you. Trade your life for hers. Out. This fabric all around us, just look. Or ask that dock worker over there. Okay. It's really a terrible place to be stranded. A ship murdering town. Oh, wow. Okay. I, there's no way I can help you. Such a good ship she was. Who must be going? Be. Yeah. No more. Okay, I need wood more than. I must stay busy working this dock. It's hard, but fulfilling for me. Can I get in here? Oh, I can. Whoop! 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 Okay. I have lots of cloth. I feel like it's the wood. I'm ah oh, wood. <gasps> it's a bear. Watch your step there. Lots of moving boxes around here. You looking a little waterlogged. Guessing he just came in off of that ship. I think you even got some seaweed hanging from your ear. Yeah, we all have those days, right? I mean, uh, my dad got in a shipwreck once. He wasn't as lucky as you, though. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. Oh, no, he's, he's, he's fine. Just lost his leg is all. Now he gets to order us around even more. So, you'll probably be exploring all over, right? Would you do me a huge favor? Sure. My brother loves raspberry-filled pastries. Loves them. He can't get enough, but raspberries don't grow here. So, he puts in an overseas order every two weeks. It's crazy, really. Now, the thing he hates is grape-filled pastries. I, I mean, we all hate them, obviously, but he hates them even more. He'd destroy them all if he could, you know? He once saw an old lady eating some, and he grabbed the box and threw it in the ocean. It was the craziest thing. I mean, okay, rude. So what I did was fill his raspberry pastry bag with, uh, <laughs> grape pastries. Can you imagine what he's gonna do when he eats one? <laughs> He'll go insane. <laughs> He's always suspicious of me doing something like this, though, so it would be perfect if you could play along and act like you're a uh, delivery person. So, what do you say? Will you deliver them to him? Sure. Perfect. You gotta play the part, though. Really make him think they're raspberry pastries. <laughs> This'll be great. Here, take these. My brother lives over in Nava, so I'll meet you there in a few days, all right? I'll probably be near the bakery. You just come find me, and I'll point my brother out to you. Okay. Cool. Gonna be a prankster. Hope I get something out of it. Okay. So first things first. Let's climb to the top here and paint that. Whoop. 
Okay, the music got weird, but okay. Yeah, top of the building, right? The center building. Oh, I think I need to craft. I do need more wood. Okay. I like to make it pretty big. I like it how you can see it happening. Oh, is this not part of mom's wishes? It looks like a pretty place. Okay. Mom's wish. Uh, she wished me to paint four of her favorite places. A giant tree anywhere on the top of Camo's Buff, the highest peak, and the view from the top of the common tower in the big city. Okay. And then, oh. Still trying to learn the controls. Sorry, everyone. Prankster pastry. Okay. This one I completed. A woman traveled with us, asked me to fetch her book. Okay, so these ones are complete. So I just got to head to Nova and then get to Tinfa Bluff and to the big city. Let's see if I can find some more. Um, wood or whatever real quick that's a beautiful scenery oh hello person. a great viewpoint isn't it lovely you must be the traveler from the wrecked ship oh a case well arrested me oh good ingolf needs some visitors every now and then i wish he would spend more time in town but he'd rather be alone. Do you live in Lundau? Yes, I run the inn. I always keep a full stock of soup and tea to refresh weary travelers. When I was young, I traveled all over this island. I'd love to adventure again one day. She's the one that wants the Look, eclipse. The eclipse is starting. No! I don't have... be a great moment if I had the paint thing. How often does the eclipse happen? Pretty though. I needed more wood. Not a bad show, right? Oh, I miss seeing it. And from Hologram. It's been a while since I've really watched it. I try to come up here every day. Oh, the daily thing. I guess it just doesn't get old for me. Anyway, if you haven't got lodging for the night, feel free to stay at the inn. I'll leave the upstairs room unlocked for you. Drop in at your leisure. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry about payment. Shipwreck survivors stay free of charge. Oh, that's nice. Take care now. Oh, they have a ship and person. Okay, cool. So I can watch the eclipse from over here. And it's a daily event. So I can still try to paint that. Okay. I'm assuming this must be the end here because no one's told me where the end is. Okay, did I go this way? Nope. So I got wood, like six, but I don't have any more black. Like a rat. Okay. Oh, an owl. There's nothing like a good book on a day such as this. Actually, books are the perfect way to spend any day. Do you enjoy reading? I don't do it much. I'll say yes, but I don't. I'm glad to hear that. Perhaps I can share my favorite books with you sometime. 
My favorite books are the ones that inspire me to write myself. How about you? We creatives, me a writer, you a painter, we've got to stay inspired. Best way I've found is to drink many, many cups of tea. Oh, okay. It always gives me a boost. So that tea I have will boost. Speaking of writing, if you find any feathers around here, I'd happily buy them. I'm constantly losing my quills. I figure three should do it. Okay. For now, though, I must get back to reading. I think something fabulously dramatic is about to happen. Is there something else? No. Many of the folk from old Lindau moved there after the mudslide. The library there is of a historic note. Lindau used to be right on the river until a mudslide destroyed most of the town. After that, the townspeople relocated to the coast. Oh, so maybe when the mother was here, else? it was actually at the river. Alright, I'll find you feathers. Oh, wow. Big place. Oh. Open. Ah! Floor, floor. I gotta find. Oh, is that a feather? Is this a toll? Uh, how much money do I have? Uh, none. Okay, I can't cross the bridge. No one's here to see it. Maybe I can just cross. I don't see any cameras. Oh. I don't know. I don't have inventory limit, it seems like. And I don't know when I'll need sticks. Very pretty. We're just exploring now. Hopefully everyone's having fun. I wish there was more music. It's very... I mean, there's lots of... There's some... Okay. Oh, wow. Kind of sad. <gasps> Property of your crying. It's been... Raining for several weeks now. Tons of water pouring down in constant torrent. Our homes is filled with buckets to catch spills from every growing leaf. How long for a moment of clear skies and a break from this scent drip dripping? As I try to sleep. Disaster has struck last night just after eclipse. The red feather feathers woke to a cracking and groaning. They they grabbed their children and ran outside the moment before the house split from its split and crashed into the river below. Madame Baker has ordered an evacuation of all. Of all Lindell. Until he can fortify our homes against the awful wet. The terrible news and only a day after we evacuate our homes and made up camp on high ground the entire of our happy village. Oh. Mainland is in a huge gush, taking our homes down with it. What a horrible thing the weather has come upon us. Sad. Oh, a candle? Candle? Oh, this was... Oh, and wood! Guess you can build a canvas now. Oh, Nela the Water Fox. Nela Lance laid out his blankets in a patch of sunlight. His water fox, Nadia, sniffed about, searching for a nest of eggs to snack on. Snack on. Samick's growling, he pulled a satchel of frosted biscuits and berry wine from his pack. Nidala howled in excitement. He found a nest. With a thick crunch, she cracked into the egg, hungrily lapping out the content before Earth lapping out the content before battling the empty show aside. Feeling so famous as she start, stared at, on her second egg. As charming as he found with well, otter fox, he couldn't stomach their eating habit. Oh, so I wonder if we can find a water fox. If we find a, um... Okay, so I have enough 
to do fill one more. Okay. Oh, yeah, we're okay. It's a good place to come. Found a single feather. The abandoned watch. It's locked. Okay. But it's like too dangerous to enter. Neat seeing the um abandoned city. So. Oh. It's not really abandoned, it was destroyed and it's not livable, but it's... Mm. I want to get back on this rail. There it is. I have lots of these berries. Found any feathers. More sticks, I guess. This one. It's flat ground. Oh. Don't know when I'll need them. Gathering. Much bigger than I thought it would be. Boop, 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 boop. I wish the music kept playing. It just, when it stopped, it so eerie. Oh, did I pick something up new? We'll be heading over here. Oh, first there. A bird! Can I have your feather? Where did it go? out of three which might give me enough money to go onto that hole Whatever. oh I've been here forgot about you kid he looks like a ninja owl or silent so if I'm in a location is there music then I'll And what's the just a random house? I break in. Don't mind me. Who's there? Nika? Is that you? No. Well, I can tell by your voice that you're not Nika. Oh. You're being smart with me. You must be one of the tourists. Terrible about the sinking and all that. Glad you're okay. Yada yada, etc. Uh, but will you go get Nika, the innkeeper? I need help. I can do that. It's stuck, obviously. Now, would you be so kind as to go get Nika for me? Can I not help you? Sure. Brilliant. I'll wait here. Uh. Yep. Okay, nothing for me to take. I'll be back there. I'll go get her. Oop. If he's still over here. Oh, I'm crouching. Uh, wait, no. She was up here? 
Let's see if she's at the end. Oh, she is at the end. Ah, the traveling artist. Uh. Uh. That. Oh, of course he does. And what is it this time? Out. Again? That's like the eighth time. All right, then, we gotta <coughs> go help. Yes? <coughs> Sorry about that, didn't mean to cough. I brought you help. I brought you help. You coming? Oh, your antlers are poking out. Oh, it's really stuck, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty stuck. I think what we need here is some soap. Would you be a dear and fetch some soap from Amin's house? It's just down the stairs and across the courtyard. Okay. Oh, must be this one. Down the stairs, across the courtyard. Uh, this is, must be get to no town walk. Do you have anything I can raid first? Oh. Hello there. Can I help you, traveler? I borrow soap. Soap? Well, certainly. May I ask why? Uh, he did. Hmm. Is he a friend of yours? Uh, work. Well, I shouldn't gossip then. What? The dirt? He's just such a peculiar man. And you know what? I think Lenny is going to have some real issues when he grows up. Like well, that? you've seen him. The boy is unhinged. Oh. And not just that. I've been hearing a lot of yelling coming from that house. I think it's quite a broken home. You know, I imagine you'll be traveling all around this island, being a tourist and all. Perhaps when you get to Nova, you should let the sheriff know about Isan. I think it's only right, you know, for Lenny. I think it'd be best for the child. I only have his best interest at heart. Isan is not a stable man, and wholly unsuitable to be a parent. Here, this will help you with the toll. Right, well, here's some soap. Safe travels. See, now the music's really loud, but then there's other parts of the game where the music is really quiet. I got soap. Oh. You have the soap? Well, let's try this thing then. Here, let me have that soap. It's soap. Well, I guess it was convenient that you dropped in when you did. Thanks for getting Nika. Well, you are a nosy tourist, aren't you? Beeswax! I mean, that nosy, stuck-up, goody, two-talon... Uh, if you had to deal with what I have to deal with... And what's that? She just doesn't like me because I'm not posh like her. This whole town is stuck up. Them and all their judging eyes. You know what? Get out of my house. You're just like everyone else in this town. Coming in here and telling me I'm a bad father? Get out! I didn't say you were a bad father. I know that's what you meant. Just get out! That's his kid there, though. Kid loves him, and his kid doesn't. Well, getting dark. I feel so adventurous staying here in Nendo. 
I live in Naba, but sometimes I just long for the primitive lifestyle Lindo offers. How humorous you are! I like that in a person. Some may find the story of my journey utterly inspiring. Nothing could have prepared me for the muddy paths, the unbearable heat. I even had to eat outside! Overall, it was a dreadful experience, but I braved through it all. Wow, he's a snob. Yes, it certainly was impressive on my part. I so dearly wish my friends could see how adventurous I've become. Hey, sir. Are oh, they just staring at me? Give me some space. We've had quite a few shipwrecks here. There's a reef surrounding the bay, and that's what does it. It shouldn't slow down traffic too much, though. I'm just glad you all made it. I remember playing in there as a kid. The ocean looks beautiful from the top. I wish it wasn't locked up. How was it? Why? That was the original Lindau. The town got destroyed after it rained every day for a solid month. The hill just slid away. There might be some stuff worth salvaging out there. All right. You look well. Towers like that were used to send fire signals to Nava. But we don't need to do that anymore. It's a bit eerie, but late the other night... I thought I saw lights coming from inside the tower. Oh. oh, it's probably just some kids playing a prank. That's where we all used to live. There was just so much rain one year. Luckily, we had the foresight to get out before the mudslide. No one got physically hurt, but the whole town was devastated. I can see that. That's losing that. Certainly. The to keep you warm on a cold night. This brew is made with honey from the remote west coast. And then this one. The okay. So that's gonna be the one thing if I'm out late. Okay, if this is the inn and I wanna sleep at night, this must be where I can stay. Take the candle. Take the paper. The clock. Another book. Architect of Londo. Londo's buildings are engineering marvels. They're difficult to construct as they are beautiful. The designs of the technical and dear are the work of an aesthetic genius, Azadel of Paria. Five years ago, this incredible architect vanished. He's, his whereabouts remain mystery to this day. Though praised for his accomplishment in engineering architecture, it's perhaps most widely recognized throughout East Side for a rare Senate fabrical disagreement, a polarizing celebrity. Many praise his genius, while others resent his supposedly ingredient disposition. Some even claim that his notoriety is owed entirely to his disfigurement. Implying that his credit skills in actuality are nothing more than ordinary. However, one only needs to look at around the town of Lindo to see how his, he felt something wonderful. Also, they're saying he only got popular because how he looked. That's kind of mean. Okay. Boop. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can get to the watchtower before it gets, I get too cold. I don't even know what happens if I get cold. Oh. Cool. I need one more feather now. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah. And I need one more board to make another canvas. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Is this kind of where? Oh. 
Okay. Oh. Cool. I got all the quill feathers. Does that have light? I can't tell. It doesn't look like it's lit to me. Beautiful though. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Look at you there. Town's right over there. Town's right over there. We might. I need to go inside. We're trying to get inside. There is a. Okay, hold on. After sunset exploring without a means of going out of the question. Okay. Got a new book. Book tales. Long ago, the air outside the planet grew terribly cold without any fur or feathers for protectors. Then began to freeze. She decided to make her flames as big and as hot as possible to keep herself warm. Sun awoke all day and night to keep her fires burning. Enormous flames reached all the way out of the, our soul, soil and began to scorch the creatures here. Great fires rage, destroying homes and forests, but Sun was too exhausted to notice. Growing worried, the plants and the creatures decided to, to help her. Oh no! Nope. That's... Oh, there it is. Together they, they gather twigs, leaves, fur, and feathers, and wove them something all together into a large sheet of fabric. They covered it with clay to protect her from fire, and the trees lifted the woven mass into the sky. Take this blanket to rest yourself in warmth, the creatures cried. Sun slipped under the blanket and wrapped herself tightly. Her flames pulled and dimmed, leaving a land cre and creatures in darkness. When Sun awoke from her nap, her golden light returned to the creatures, who danced and sung, thankful that the gift had worked, and so... This is the story of the sun's blanket, which she still uses each day. So pretty much it's a blanket. A blanket is the sky. Okay, is it still nighttime? I don't know. Did time pass? Oh yeah. So that's what I need the tea for. And then this the room. Okay. This is how I save. Okay. So that's how we pick how time passes. We got the feathers. Would like to drop off the feathers real quick. And then I think after we drop off the feathers. We will Whoop. Okay. Okay. Let's... Is he over here? Oh, yes, yes. I got you feathers. Aha, my fellow bookworm. Uh. Oh, wonderful. Hopefully this is enough to last me a while. Thank you very much. I do hate scouring the forest floor for these. If you find any more, I'll pay you one close than a piece. Oh, cool. Is there something else? No, uh, no. Okay. What's this? Well, I guess once I find it, I might be able to slide down. Oh. Three. Okay. Um, so I said I needed 60 for the toll. So I might have to look for a whole bunch of feathers. Wow, I should have came here for my feather hat. 
You didn't have to look far. You could have got lots of feathers down over here. You're just lazy, dude. Alright. Throw some feathers. Cool. Alright. Maybe I should have kept one or two of those in case I had a mission or another quest for them. Gotta do the eclipse. Watch me soar like a bird. Up there. I actually forgot I got up there. I wonder if one of the quests is gonna to be meet the um oh, bird okay so I th those birds aren't moving okay they're stuck so I think that's where we'll stop right now saved earlier. Well, it's a nice relaxing game. I enjoyed it. Like I said, it's nice and relaxing. I wish the music continued the whole time. Like it wasn't just in random areas that where music starts playing. Let me know if you guys are more interested in me continuing this and we'll see you next time.